Seoul is really here to support students, international students and students with difficulties. For example, I am profoundly deaf since birth, so I have some hearing impairments. And I'm sure you haven't noticed that from the, since the beginning of the video, but that's just the way it is. And UCL was here to um, make sure that I will have enough support and access to everything despite my disability. So this is once again just to prove you that UCL is really here to make sure that all of its students um, are fulfilled and feeling like at home actually at UCL. So really there are resources and people to help everywhere. So it's very easy to get what you want. And so I really feel like I'm part of the community at, at UCL and that's really reassuring. We are all human and we can't study 24 hours 7, it's just not possible. So it's very important to have something beside, just to really stress and do something different than studying. So for myself, uh, it was rock climbing because I practiced that sport for two years now and I really wanted to carry on um, this at uni. And I'm sure you can find your society um, at UCL because there are more than 300 clubs and societies about music, sports, art, culture, business, um, law, whatever. You can really find whatever you want. And so, and I really recommend you guys to join one of them because this is the place where you're going to meet new friends other than friends from your course, from your degree, from your accommodation and yeah it's just a really fun way to get out of the stress of assignments, deadlines and so on. Um, so that's it for the three points I really wanted to focus on for you guys making the right decision about your university and please remember that UCL is really here to support and welcome anyone so it's very international, as you may know, and it takes up people from all backgrounds. So you really, we all, we, you said it's kind of a big family and we want to make sure that everyone is feeling happy there. So, and, and of course, New Soul is here to help. Um, once again, normally every department is having a mentoring service, which is consisting of um, mentors from second, third or fourth year students that are here to guide you through the first year, the first trimester of studies. Um, and this really helped me. So don't hesitate to ask them all of your questions. They are here to help you and make sure that you're making the most of it, uh, the most of your time at UCL. The biggest positive points of UCL is the Moodle, Moodle page, which is the online platform where you can find all the details about your different modules, your different um, courses, your different assignments, everything is explained on there. And for each module, you have like um, a lecture cost. And this thing really saved me because it's where you can basically find all of your courses that were recorded and filmed. And while you are in the, in the lecture, the lectures are going quite fast because they have to go through many many informations and they don't have that much time they, don't, they usually have only one or two hours to do this so you as a student you only have time to write down the most important points and you cannot obviously write down everything which is why lecture class was really helpful because you can pause go back go forward the lecture to understand one particular point that you didn't understand before Social life at UCL is very active and the Fashions Week are the busiest period of the year in terms of events and parties going on because everything is happening at the same time. The hardest part is just to choose which uh, event to go to and I really recommend that to go to the events um, and to uh, 
yeah go to the events go to the parties meet new people this is where you're gonna get over your shyness in case you're shy and um it's super super easy to make new friends and to meet new people and once you've gone through the freshers week you can basically speak to everyone also there are many places around your cell that are that are just amazing there are a lot of cafes a lot of bars that are held by um students of ucl of course and i'm gonna share with you one of my favorite ones it's called molly's and it's just a bar of ucl it's like an underground bar and this bar is just amazing because every saturday is having like a karaoke night and it's just so funny to go around there with friends or with part with people from your society and everyone is just having so much fun so yeah the social life at USL is really present and you're gonna make so many new friends in such a short amount of time at UCL there are many places of course where you can study you can basically study everywhere but one of my favorite ones will be the science library um it's very silent if you like to study like in a very silent place without any noise around you there's also the student center you have a, a very nice view on ucl and and there are huge windows and the atmosphere at the student center is really relaxing the peaceful place and it was just amazing for me to go there and study um the only thing is to go there early because it's a very famous place for student yourself students to study of course there's the main library which is just incredible it's so beautiful but it's quite busy as well you have to go there quite early and um you can basically study everywhere in the cafes there are common rooms kind of common rooms if you want to for different departments and the one for biology is called the student hub the anatomy hub and we always go there to have lunch or just chat with friends between lectures thanks to all for watching and if you have any questions feel free to ask them UCL is here to help and we all hope that we are going to welcome you next year